Yesterday, we learned about a cyclist struck and killed by a car. It happened just before 5 p.m. on University near Jordan Lane. We have learned today that the cyclist was a father of two boys. Our Ayana Willoughby spoke with his family about the funeral and what the community it can do to help. He was wonderful. He, he, was, he was a big... He's a big football fan in Tennessee. He cared a lot about his 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 kids. Yesterday, a portion of University Drive was backed up for a few hours after a man was fatally hit by a car while riding a bike. The victim, Joshua Gurley, was 37. I know that it's, he was coming back from work from construction. It was around 440 while he was riding back home from work via bike and he was hit by a car. The accident happened near Oster Drive, and it is still unclear what caused it. Gurley leaves behind two kids, an 18-year-old named Austin Gurley and a 7-year-old named Lincoln Gurley. His family says he enjoyed history, astronomy, and sports. He recently became a Christian before he passed. Father was a very kind, compassionate man. He had a lot of responsibility with me and my brother. He also had a responsibility with the entire family as well. And he really took it upon himself and worked his way out. Gurley's family has started a GoFundMe to help move his body from Alabama to Tennessee, where he will be laid to rest. His sister, Brandy Gurley, says the money will also help with his two sons. So help uh, support me and my eight-year-old brother, too, I believe. And uh, it'll go towards that. Putting the Valley first, I'm Ayanna Willoughby, WZDX News.